we will look at how much Ripple XRP do I need to retire in 2022. Would you like to get loaded enough to retire by 2022? Then stick around and watch this video to the end to find out how you could get rich investing in XRP. Welcome to Moneyside. Hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications for more. The cryptocurrency market has grown immensely since its early days. Cryptocurrency adoption is also skyrocketed as people have grasped the whole concept behind them and are ready to benefit from their numerous importance. There are thousands of cryptocurrencies in the market right now, with more being created almost every month. These cryptocurrencies are each created with a different goal, from those designed to provide a digital currency alternative to fiat currencies, to those who support payment systems, peer-to-peer -peer trading activities, underlying protocol, as well as those that facilitate secure access to goods or services in peer-to-peer -peer trading. As the cryptocurrency market continues to grow, new digital coins and projects will continue to emerge. However, many people believe that the influx of these new cryptocurrencies does more harm than good to the market, as many of them fail, fueling the already speculative notion that cryptocurrencies are not something that will last. Is the rise of a multitude of cryptocurrencies a good thing for the market and investors, or not? Cryptocurrencies provide an endless pool of opportunities for investors. Digital currencies also offer their users something far more than what traditional banks have offered over the years. Having a wider range of cryptocurrencies to choose from is a plus for the market, as investors come in different forms depending on their money. The endless number of cryptocurrencies to choose from is also one of the market's strong suits. Relatively lower digital coins have the potency of fetching your investment gains, just like the bigger coins would. A large number of cryptocurrencies do matter, and that has been evidence over the years in numerous investor crypto portfolios. However, too many cryptocurrencies on the market also has a downside, which over the years has been the perception of failure. There are over 5,000 cryptocurrencies now in the crypto market, and as of November last year, there were 1,185 dead or failed cryptocurrencies. These numbers in the public eye are very alarming, as it derails the confidence that is associated with cryptocurrency as being a long-term investment. A newbie or green investor looking to buy their first cryptocurrency will wander into many thoughts when the number of failed cryptocurrencies is brought into play. Many new crypto projects are designed by crypto developers with perceived superiority attributes, only for it to be past news upon its arrival, as many other cryptocurrencies also possess those qualities. The cryptocurrency market will continue to grow, and the growing number of digital coins will be an inevitable part. However, projects with poor execution will continue to fail, as the crypto market is already in competition with these huge and equipped financial institutions. However, most people aren't thinking about trying to invest or trade in cryptocurrency. Meanwhile, recent history shows that it often can be a very good idea. Of course, cryptocurrency is risky, just like any other investment with a potentially high return. Here are a few clear-cut benefits. It's an independent alternative. With major wealth investors predicting a stock market crash in 2021, cryptocurrency may be a safer alternative to more traditional investment solutions. Opposing theories exist on how cryptocurrencies would behave in the event of a crash. After all, they emerged after the 2008 crash and as a reaction to it. Some experts believe they will thrive, while pessimists predict that they will be negatively affected, just like everything else. Simplicity Getting into any kind of investment, be it stocks, bonds, or something else entirely, is traditionally complicated, bothersome, and time-consuming. Many investment opportunities, for example, real estate, have an extremely high entry threshold. You can't just invest 100 bucks. You need a much more significant sum at your disposal to even get started. Cryptocurrencies are a real sign of the times. Both joining and taking part is simple. You don't have to deal with any institutions, sign papers, or visit banks. You simply create an account, get a wallet, and track all your assets with no effort at all. Hit that subscribe button for more. High liquidity. One of the primary characteristics of any asset is its liquidity. That is, how easy it is to purchase or sell at a price close to the market rate. By their very nature, cryptocurrencies have a very high liquidity. You can quickly and easily buy and sell them, and the technological organization of trading platforms allows for the use of a wide variety of tools and tactics, such as limit orders, automated buying and selling at a specific price, and algorithm-based trading. 
Your money is yours alone. Cryptocurrencies offer you a level of independence impossible with other means. When you keep your money in a bank, you are at the mercy of other people and organizations. At any moment, your access to your money that is rightfully yours can be limited or closed by the bank outside of governmental structures. The bank can be robbed or go bankrupt. With cryptocurrencies, your money is yours only and stays yours forever. You don't rely on financial institutions for holding or transferring it. You don't have to pay their exorbitant fees. In the long run, it can become the basis of a truly open and decentralized economy. By investing now, you can be at the forefront of it all. Incredible Returns Let us get the most notable thing out of the way first. Cryptocurrencies have been around for a relatively short time, but so far, they can be more profitable than most other investments. For example, the highest return you can expect from U.S. stocks is about 20%, which is considered a very solid result. Cryptocurrencies tend to show wide changes in their prices over relatively short periods. It is risky, but high profits are never sure, and such potential is hard to find in other assets. Many people lose money in crypto trading because they try to do it without any specific strategy. Decentralization is the process of distributing and dispersing power away from a central authority. Most financial and governmental systems which are currently in existence are centralized, meaning that there is a single highest authority in charge of managing them, such as a central bank or state apparatus. There are several crucial disadvantages to this approach, stemming from the fact that any central authority also plays the role of a single point of failure in the system. Any malfunction at the top of the hierarchy, whether unintentional or deliberate, inevitably harms the entire system. Bitcoin was designed as a decentralized alternative to government money, and therefore doesn't have any single point of failure, making it more resilient, efficient, and democratic. Its underlying technology, the blockchain, is what allows for this decentralization, as it offers every single user an opportunity to become one of the network's many payment processors. Since Bitcoin's appearance, many other cryptocurrencies or altcoins have appeared, and most of the time they also use the blockchain to achieve some degree of decentralization. Difference between Bitcoin and XRP Bitcoin operates on a public blockchain ledger that supports a digital currency used to facilitate payments for goods and services. Bitcoin, the network, is primarily known for its Bitcoin cryptocurrency. The Bitcoin network is based on the blockchain concept, a public ledger of verified transactions and record keeping. Miners verify transactions on an ongoing basis and add them to the Bitcoin blockchain which serves as a ledger of all activity across the network. In exchange for their time and their computing power necessary to validate the ledger in this way, miners are rewarded with Bitcoin upon successfully validating certain qualities of transactions. XRP, on the other hand, is a technology that is mainly known for its digital payment network and protocol. Aside from the cryptocurrency XRP, Ripple is perhaps even better known as a payment settlement, asset exchange, and remittance system that works more like SWIFT a service for international money and security transfers that is used by a network of banks and financial intermediaries. Instead of using the blockchain mining concept, the Ripple network uses a unique distributed consensus mechanism through a network of servers to validate transactions. By conducting a poll, the servers or nodes on the network decide by consensus about the validity and authenticity of the transaction. This enables almost instant confirmations without any central authority, which helps keep Ripple decentralized and yet faster and more reliable than many of its competitors. While Bitcoin is seeing increasing use by individuals and organizations as a virtual currency, the Ripple payment system is more popular among banks. RippleNet is a consortium of more than 200 financial institutions based in more than 40 countries, allowing for easy facilitation of cross-border payments. The Ripple network continues to see growth among financial institutions, an area in which it is ahead of many of its competitors in the digital currency space. Based on current projections, most people within the business agree that Ripple's value can go up to the $200 to $300 range in 10 years. It's in the company's best interest if the price continues to rise, because it'll make XRP less volatile. Please keep in mind, we are not a licensed financial advisor. All videos on this channel are intended for entertainment purposes only. Now, tell us what you think the future looks like for Ripple in the comment section below, and let's have a conversation. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and click on the subscribe button below. Turn on notifications to get informed whenever we post our amazing content.
We'll see you in the next video.